So, uh, well, congratulations on the film. Thank the, you. When I saw the first one, it was only you, right? Right, that's so right. So why, um, I'm just wondering, why in this case you need two directors as opposed oh, to just I just got one? tired, Rosa. <laughs> I'm so tired. Um, well, I, I've been working with Phil for 10 years. Phil wrote the first one. Uh, and then the two of us um, worked on Zootopia together, me as a director and Phil as a writer. And uh, from that experience on Zootopia, Phil did way more than just write the movie. You know, he, he was like another director in the room as we were finishing that film. And when we went on to this Ralph sequel, I asked Phil, like, would you would you like to be my co-director? So on I got on one knee. I got on one <laughs> <Yeah>. knee. <laughs> presented a ring. You know, he's wearing it, right? Oh, oh no. Uh, no, I wear it oh, around my, my goodness. It's around my neck. Oh, my oh, goodness. Okay. Yeah, yeah, so it's oh, closer he to my lost heart. It. Closer to my heart. Have you been <laughs> Ali Catton with no. another director? No, I love you only. I love you only. That's what I like to hear. Yes, you're you're my you're my best friend and directing. Sometimes partner. we joke around. <laughs> so um uh what do you guys want kids to get from the film? What would be the, the main message you, you want mm. them to, to get after watching the film? I hope kids will see versions of their friendships in the friendship between Ralph and Vanellope, which includes the huge mistakes that both Ralph and Vanellope make in the movie. It's a movie about change and about friendship and that good friendships can weather difficult changes. And, you know, I know my kids, when they see it, relate to their buddies and see, oh, I, I was that way. I was being possessive of my friend, mm -hmm. and that's not right. But also, Vanellope is withholding truth from Ralph, and that's mm -hmm. not right either. So both of our characters make pretty big mistakes, and that's okay. That's what friendship is. That's what every relationship is. And I'm hopeful that kids will see that and, and feel okay about you know, the, 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 the mistakes they make and ways that they can make it better, that mm -hmm. they can fix it, and that a friendship can grow stronger because of that. Mm -hmm. um, I think diversity these days is very important in mm. movies in general. How do you think, like, the Hispanic market or uh, Hispanic-speaking audience are going to uh, react to the movie? Um, well, I, I mean, would... I would hope they they would love it like we do. You know, <laughs> like that's, anybody that's else? What we, that's what we... Uh, we talk about the movie as it's kind of our baby, you know. So when you release your, your child into the world, you hope that it's uh, uh, accepted and embraced by all people. Um, and, and I think that, that uh, Spanish-speaking kids or German-speaking kids or Italian kids or whatever, everyone has an experience on the Internet mm -hmm. that is universal in a way. It's the World Wide Web. And we, we tried to put Ralph and Vanellope in situations that are familiar to anyone who goes on the mm -hmm. Internet. So, unfortunately, online bullying and trolling are universal things that, that kids in Spain deal with as much as kids in, in Los Angeles, you know. Mm -hmm. So I would be hopeful that the world sort of has a universal understanding of what the Internet is and what's good about it and what's terrible about it. Mm -hmm. I, I wanted to ask you, you work mm -hmm. on... Um, on the Simpsons, I, yes. I, was, I heard on the radio that uh, the character of Apple was they are getting rid of him because people were complaining that he was politically incorrect. Oh. And I, I I heard it in a radio podcast mm. uh, from Spain, and everybody was upset because it feels like in Spain we're a little different and we're not so politically mm -hmm. correct. Mm -hmm. So they were complaining that they they are getting like rid the of character. him. I want since you worked on the show, I wanted to see if, if it's well, like I, a little too much the politically correctness and they. Oh, what's your take on that? Well, um, this is kind of the first time I'm hearing about it, and I I loved working on that show, you know, with, with that group of people, and those are still, it's been 30 years, and it's the same group of people, you know, that make that show, and um, I regard them as very smart people that, that have their finger on, on what's going on in society, and if that's how they choose to, you know, to address the issue, then... I support him because I I have a very deep faith in in the makers of that show. So whatever they choose, I think that's that's good for them. All right. On that note, we don't thank have you. more time. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Nice talking to you.